Hello, I'm Bradley and welcome to my video. Today, short and choppy. That's the style which I'm going for. So today is a complete overhaul change of what I'm usually uh, usually sort of used to. So from those sort of nice and neat pompadours or lots of sort of texture going on but have a really, really neat and professional, all those comb sort of classic side slip back styles or just those slip back styles uh, with the use of a comb or pomade or any sort of like gel product. Today, very, very quick and to the point of really sort of quite flicky, short, choppy. And that's the style which I really wanted to go for. I've tried it several times on and off throughout my life. And it's a style which very often I come back to usually around about the summertime because it's cut into, it's a lot cooler and it feels just a lot fresher if it's a little bit hotter outside. So perfect for the summer months. How did I do this style? So jumping straight in, my choice today, because my hair is, as you may have sort of realized from a lot of my clips at all, I've got quite a lot of hair, but it is a finer texture of hair. So today I have gone in with the John Frieda and this is the energizing shampoo. This is from the Lift system. There's a helicopter flying just up above me uh, over my home at the moment. So if you can hear that, I do apologize. I'm just going to carry on. So this shampoo here, energizing shampoo, this is from the Lift system and the John Frieda men's range, which I'm using on and off over the past couple of weeks. This is all about extending that fresh haircut style from the barbers. So first thing, use a shampoo, massaged into my scalp, then rinse through. You should have a lot more sort of uh, texture and it gives that slight lift as well. Then I've gone in to calm down my hair. And when I say calm my hair down, rather than it sort of being too textured or a little bit frizzy almost, um, it the conditioner, which is from the thicker hair range to calm that down, that just sort of brings my hair down a little bit more smoother and it sort of calms everything down so I can actually create a nice style um, rather than sort of a bit of frizz in amongst my hair. So really, really great for that and it gives me a lot more manageability. And it is from the control system. It's aimed at slightly thicker hair, but there is no conditioner in the lift system. So I always sort of go to this in the range. A really nice product it's the calming conditioner and this one here has got cucumber extract and that's what calms the hair and the cuticles down of the hair back to the shampoo it's carotene protein which binds to the hair and makes the hair fuller and a little bit more easier to style so then i've got shorter hair at the moment so i have then washed the conditioner out then rather than sort of jumping in with a dryer or anything i have literally just towel dried my hair off and then i've left my hair sort of slightly damp then what I've done is I've gone in with a new product which I picked up recently and this actually was in a local supermarket. So this one um, is a, a product which was next to all the Head and Shoulders products, the Alpazine um, and sort of aimed at those sort of men's range products. But I believe this is for men and women. Uh, so this one here is for thicker, fuller hair. And this here is root lifting serum with organic quinola and caffeine so scalp to strand care for thin and thinning hair so absolutely i haven't got thinning hair but i do find i do have a thinner uh, finer texture of hair of course very different things thin to fine hair thin is of course the actual amount of follicles you have on your head um, and of course fine is the actual diameter and texture of the hair um, so yes, two very different things. So I believe I've got fine hair. Um, some days, of course, I do think it's a little bit thin, but of course, sometimes some products, some use of products, and of course, make hair feel a little bit lank or a little bit flat. So very often, if I'm out and about and I see products for sort of thin hair or finer hair, or even thinning hair, of course, I can get right back on uh, sort of trying out those products. Um, I always think that prevention is better than cure. So if I can stay on top of full hair, then absolutely great. So this product here, it is a little bit more expensive, in fact, I'll just go back to the shampoo and the conditioner. So they are £7.50 currently. So I think I'd previously done a video and they're around £9.50. Um, they are £7.50 at the moment and I am buying those in boots. So the price does usually sometimes vary slightly. Um, the styling products are £9.50 in that range. So it's a little bit more than your sort of go-to sort of uh, store, perhaps store uh, product for hair care. But they are really great products in the John Frieda men's range. Just going back to the serum which I used after freshly shampooed and conditioned hair this morning. This is the root lifting serum with organic quinola and caffeine, scalp to strand hair for thin or and thinning hair, thicker full of hair, 100% vegan, sulfate free and gluten free. So this is all about needing a lift. So uh, needing a lift in that hair. So define gravity for uh, for great looking fullness and mega volume. A caffeine fixed for thin and thinning hair. This 100% vegan formula contains the triple shots of powerful botanicals uh, to lift hair at the roots and provide all over protection. Visible 
thicker and fuller hair achieved hair goals res uh, realized sorry i usually do wear glasses with small print there's incredibly small print on here so do forgive me for that and actually i jumped in and said gravity for great uh, looking fullness but it's actually for fabulous looking fullness and mega volume that's because I couldn't quite make out the word fabulous but as I was reading down I seen the word fabulous I do apologize about that so to be honest with you it's all about creating that lift so it's got uh, vegan carotene here so it's a plant-based alternative to animal de uh, detrived uh, carotene which deeply moisturizes uh, hair strands so rather than using animal based it's derived from carotene so it's also got here, we've got caffeine in. We all know about caffeine. So of course you may have seen some of my uh, videos before in regards to sort of alpazine um, and of course the Trevor Sorbet caffeine shampoo as well, which I've recently done. So if I ever see a caffeine product, I very often pick that up and try it for my hair just to get that thicker, sort of that prevention in sort of any problems occurring in the thickness of my hair. So really like this product actually. It's 11 pounds. So it is a bit more expensive, but however, I thought I would give it a try. Um, literally used uh, three pumps of the product, rubbed that through my hands, in through my hair, and instantly I always find it feels really, really gentle on your hair, really gentle, and you find almost that it, it makes the hands sort of the hair stand up ever so slightly, gives a little bit more lift. So today, with the energizing shampoo with that lift in my hair, and then the serum, perfect. So then, literally, I've just gone in really really ruffled my hair out really on the roots really massaging that serum in and then really just trying to sort of shake my hair flick it around a bit and get some texture in there then there's really not much more than what i've done then after that so when i've started to sort of mess around my hair i've got that nice texture and i've got that nice sort of flicky texture which hopefully you can sort of see with the light here i've got that nice sort of flickiness that nice texture that bit of lift from my scalp and then of course it's where you stop so then what i've done is i've gone in part of the john frieda men's uh, fresh cut uh, style range these are the styling products i've showed you the shampoo and the conditioner this is the hairspray which we have featured on a number of my other clips before but this here Humidity blocking hairspray, locks in style with all day hold, carotene protein in here as well. Really, really great product. Um, and if you want to know a little bit more detail about them, I have actually got a review on these as well. Um, I've gone through the serum in a little bit more detail because I haven't actually used this. This is a new product to me. So I haven't used it before, sorry. I have used it several times, but I'm still getting used to it and very, very new. And it's a great product. So then hairspray, what I've gone in, the liquid hairspray, a few sprays all over my hair, sort of still flicking it around just to try and get it into a nice shape. And then sort of at the back, I've lifted it up ever so slightly just to get that nice sort of textured look. A few sprays throughout my hair. Let's jump ahead and do it now. Can't never do enough of these type of sprays, I always think. So really sort of lift it up a nice little bit, really get some nice sort of texture, lift it about. As you can see, it's, I always find when to stop. I really like that sort of nice undone, sort of really nice look. And I find it makes your hair fuller. A nice style like this really does make your hair fuller. Finish my style off. What I've actually done is after I flicked it all around, um, I've sort of then just roughly pulled it off to one side. Just so I've got that nice bit of stand up, stand up uh, hair and I've got that nice sort of bit more of a modern style to it. So I've just pulled it off to one side ever so slightly. Not used to comb anything, just my hands. Then the front here, with that being slightly longer, um, because of course I have my hair cut um, done to a traditional sort of pompadour style after I had it cut shorter. Here, because it's longer in the front here, I've just literally flicked those about off to the side and then I've pulled them sort of down in the front here. So I've got those nice sort of pieces, which I believe creates a bit of a nice feature. Of course, with that nice sort of undercut, which I've got going on at the moment, it's a really nice style. Of course, another thing I should mention as well, just because you have brought those products, say, for example, I've got the John Frieda range at the moment. I'm always mixing my products up all the time. And another thing, if you have had a haircut style uh, sort of cut, for example, I went in and I really, really liked that pompadour style. So I had it cut to that doesn't mean to say that you can't style your hair in different styles as well. So perhaps something to bear in mind when you go and have your hair cut and you just want one style cut in. Bear that in mind, leave yourself some length, leave yourself uh, with a style which you're able to sort of manoeuvre into different things what you want, which will match how you feel on a day and certain situations, sort of professional, everyday, if you want a relaxed look or a, mil or a more sort of done and refined sort of look as well. So perhaps something certainly to bear in mind. So today, a really sort of not over the top, really short and choppy, um, nice style, lots of sort of texture going on where I have my hair cut, um, really nice sort of style, it's where to stop really, um, I really like that creating some nice sort of textury pieces, um, 
really like it and what I like about this is if you're not happy you can just get right back in there that's very often what I do if I've got this style so I think it looks really really cool um, I really enjoyed doing this style and I've wore this all day today and I have been out and about. Um, really, really liked it. Um, so yeah, hopefully if you can take any of the tips away what we've done from the products today um, or even how I've done my style if you like it, absolutely, I'd say go for it, give it a try. Okay, so until next time, thank you very much for watching and we will see you then. Bye bye now.